is a person that's just senseless, cruel, that needs to be brought to justice. Tomorrow, Sheriff Joe Arpaio is mobilizing his volunteer posse to find the person who shot three horses, killing one of them near the Salt River. CBS 5's Jared Dillingham has the latest on what happened, but we do want to warn you that some of the pictures are graphic. We spent the evening here along the Salt River with the people who helped to monitor these wild horses. People did witness the shootings on Friday. One horse died, a relative newborn just six months old. This is a picture of Kai, the horse found dead on Friday. He'd been shot five times in the chest, neck, and head. It looked like he suffered a lot. You know, there's a lot of blood out of his. It's, it's really gross. What's more, the horse was also mutilated. His private parts were cut off, clean cut off of them. The strangest thing we've ever seen. Before sunset, we walked with the Salt River Wild Horse Management Group, and we found the family of horses, or band, that was targeted. Well, we're still worried, very worried about two of them. Two of these horses were also shot. Tonight, they appear to be walking okay, though they were nervous as we approached. Obviously, they don't trust humans right at the moment. Witnesses say the man who opened fire on these horses was wearing black shorts and a dark green shirt and was here with two others. Right now, they have $3,500 in reward money being offered, and they've set up a GoFundMe page to help increase that reward. All the information's on our CBS 5 News app. Along the Salt River, I'm Jared Dillingham, CBS 5 News.